I want you to send this part of the show. We're going to clip it. In fact, mark it when we get up here, Tiffany, and we're going to clip this, and I want you to share just this part with your friends. I'm going to make it very, very short. And here's what I want you to send to your friends. America, I am a imperfect um, messenger for this. You can call me what you want. You can say I, I hate the president or what, whatever. It doesn't matter. I just want you to listen here for just a few minutes, and I'm going to show you some videotape. And I'm going to tell you about the big bad Republicans here. The Republicans, as well as the Democrats, are dragging us into another war. Your government is using your name, and they are sucking you into the, into the Middle East again. And only 15% of Americans think that's a good idea. 11% think we should send arms to the Syrians. But those numbers don't come with any information. Those numbers will be much, much lower if you show this to your friend. I want to warn you, what I'm going to show you is extremely graphic. But please send this along. A friend sent this to you. Please send it to another friend. This is a very graphic video of Commander Abu Sakar. He is in this video. He has just killed a Syrian um, military member. This is a rebel that is now cutting the chest open of that Syrian. He takes out his liver and his heart. And to show you what's going to happen to all of his enemies, the commander eats it. The dead soldier on the ground is the enemy of the guy we are now arming. This president and the Republicans, it's the Democrats and the Republicans, the progressives, trust this demented terrorist with weapons. Yet the same people want to take guns out of your hands because they don't trust you, but I digress. This is, in such, this is such a warning sign that we are on the wrong side that even Vladimir Putin sounds sane compared to the progressive Republicans and the progressive Democrats in Washington, including our president. Listen to what uh, President Putin just said. I believe you will not deny the fact that uh, one hardly should back those who kills their enemies and uh, you know, eats their organs uh, and all that is filmed and shot. Do you want to support these people? Do you want to supply arms to these people? Okay. America, I, I, I am, I'm begging you, I'm begging you. We have to put down our partisan politics. We have to stop. When Vladimir Putin is making the case to the American people, do you want to give guns to the people who are eating the heart and liver out of their enemies? It's a no-brainer. We must stop the people in Washington. We've got to stop intervening in the wars in the Middle East. I hate this. Sounds awful. But if they're going to kill each other, let them kill each other. We will not survive this. Please, stop the back and forth of the Republicans and Democrats. Our children and our country are at stake at this point.